My friends, today is a very special day. Why is it a very special day? Because we're going on a road trip in the big Gladiator. We're going on a road trip. We're going to go pick up an SCX-10 Gladiator. Today is the day. We're stepping up the scales. I found a great deal on a, looks like a mint used SCX-10 Gladiator. So we're going to hop in the big Jeep here. We're going to go for a quick road trip. We're going to go pick this thing up. Then I'll come home, check it out. Maybe if the weather cooperates, it's not very nice out today. If the weather cooperates, maybe we can stop and do some crawling. But in any case, super excited because today is the day we take the leap into the big scales, getting the Gladiator that I've always been after. Since I started getting immersed in this hobby, this is what we've been waiting for. So I'm gonna bring you guys along with me. This is an exciting moment. Let's hop in the Jeep, let's go. downtown New Bedford right now. We're meeting this dude to pick up the SCX-10 right now. All right, my friends, just picked it up here. Check this out. It's got the original box and everything. It's still sealed on the other side. I'm gonna open this thing up in a little bit. Also got this Vatera drift car. I didn't even really want this, but he basically gave it to me with the Gladiator. So I've got this drift car ready to run, an extra body on it, a whole bag of parts. There's the remote for the Vatera, four or five batteries, a brand new winch, never even used, original parts, so much stuff in here, a charger for the Gladiator. There's the transmitter for the Gladiator 2. Batteries in the transmitter. The rig, man, I'm telling you, I'll open this up in a minute. The weather is terrible right now. Pick like the worst day weather-wise to go get these things. But this it, Gladiator is legit like brand new. So I'm so excited to show you guys. But I'm gonna load up here. I'm gonna head home and then I'll open these things up when we take a look at them. Gosh, the weather is nasty. It's like rain and snow mix. I am so excited to get this Gladiator, man. This is such a deal. So I found David on Facebook Marketplace. I found this Gladiator and drove about an hour to get it. It was $500 to get the Gladiator ready to run with the battery charger, all the accessories, all the original components. It's all stock, just has aftermarket wheels. Plus he threw in the Vatera V100, I think it is. So I'm super stoked on the deal. David, if you ever see this video, you just altered the direction of this channel and made myself and probably a lot of viewers really happy. So I just grabbed some lunch. Now I'm gonna head home and then open these things up and really take a closer look at them. But super pumped with this deal, glad I got it. So I just can't wait. It's terrible weather out here, but I got this awesome spot on the way home. I just got to get into this thing and do a couple runs real quick. So let me open this up and show you. First off, just look, it's still sealed over here and right there, crazy. This dude took such good care of his stuff. So look at, so it's got these Rockstar red rims on it, but otherwise it's all stock crazy good shape as the manual here it is it's got just a little bit of scuff on the hood I think it's only from the box rubbing on it see and here it is with the body off so you can see it is just like brand new it's perfect So we're out here, it's day two. We got better weather this time around, a little bit. I got, my little man is out here, up there with the Rango, <laughs> having a good time. Picked up a 3S battery for this yesterday. 
So I'm excited to try this on 3S. So it's fully powered up, ready to go. So I'm gonna put this thing together and we're gonna try this thing out. So right off the bat, I mean, I could tell from driving the other 10 scales and the larger scales that we have that the ESC and the control and the slow speed of this thing is at a whole nother level. It just gives it tremendous capability, more than I was expecting for sure. This is what it's all about right here though, getting the two of us out here. This is a lot of fun with these bigger rigs to be able to just kind of walk through trails and go on these little adventures. <laughs> Look at the rig. <laughs> this is really cool. This is worth it right here. solo again now. I dropped my little man off at home because it's starting to rain because it's rained every single day almost non-stop since I got this thing. The weather has not cooperated at all. Cold, wet, nasty out. Not going to stop me from enjoying this thing. I've been waiting too long for this moment. So we're out here getting it done and I'm still having a blast.
so close. Oh. Holy cow, that was gnarly. I'm up here at this crawling spot. This is a place that really gives the 124s a hard time. Can't wait to see how this thing does. Just so much more power. You know, we can't really get on these things. It's wild how much power it has. Big, heavy vehicle, you know, it's just a whole nother league here. I'm also thankful for the portals here. That extra ground clearance for sections like this is really helpful. Very cool, super impressive. First real outing with the 110. I think we broke it in pretty well. Definitely not gonna be a shelf queen. This is how it should look. This is how it's going to look. Might be a different color soon. But boy, wasn't this thing fun. So glad I got it. All right guys, that's gonna wrap it up for me. I'm gonna head home, I'm gonna get this thing cleaned up. I'm gonna get this content ready for you guys. I hope you enjoyed this kind of blog style format. It's a little bit different, but I was really excited for this experience and really wanted to take you guys along with me because it wouldn't have been possible without you guys and the channel. You guys have supported the channel so much. It's grown so much over the last year and I've just been having so much fun with you guys and the community is so supportive. It's just amazing. So I'm really pumped that I was able to share this with you guys and I'm so appreciative for all of you who support the channel in this journey and I'm really looking forward to building out the SCX-10 and seeing where that takes us, exploring the functionality and the capability, the cap so much capability with this thing, so much fun. But in any case, I'm just really grateful for you guys and I really appreciate it. I hope you enjoyed this, glad I could share it with you. But I'm gonna get home, get this thing cleaned up, get dry. Please like and subscribe if you haven't done so and I'll catch you in the next video.